Hi, I'm Matteo, and today I'm going to show you how we make brush-off technique into leather. But before we proceed with our process, I want you to take a look to this final product. These shoes, this leather, this is what we want to achieve today with our leather. We start from full grain leather and we have to sand it with some paper. This is a process that requires quite a long time, so I already prepared it up front. And uh, here is uh, our leather that we are going to use it today for our process. So please follow me, we are going to this machine, the roller coat. First step is uh, tighten the leather by applying impregnation. And uh, we are going to use mainly acrylic resins. Okay, so now we are gonna put it on the table and we are gonna let it rest for a few hours to let the chemical soak in. So, wait a second. Luckily, I already prepared one piece in advance. So, please follow me. This giant machine here is our vacuum dryer. It has uh, a knot plate uh, which squeezes out the water from the fiber of the leather and uh, it binds the fiber together thanks to the acrylic resin that we applied, the temperature and the pressure. Next, we have to sand the leather again and make it look like this. And then we can proceed with the next step, which is the base coat. In order to prepare the right uh, base coat mix, uh, we are going to mix together pigment, acrylic resin and uh, polyurethane and then apply them again in our roller coat. Perfect. So now we are going to dry our leather into the oven, then roller coat again and then back in the oven again. Can you speed it up a bit? Now we are going to iron our leather which is a process that is going to make our surface thin and smooth. Okay, so now Chandan will continue the process of roller coating by doing this twice, while we will go to prepare some dye stuff. Thank you, Chandan. Now, let's apply the dye on the leather. Okay, by using this cloth and a small amount of dye, I'm going to create a cloudy pattern on this leather. So now that we are done with the padding, we can continue our process by applying a layer of uh, water-based patent into our leather by using our roller coat. Perfect, now it's very shiny. Arthur, could you please uh, dry it in the oven and once dry, uh, iron it again as we did before. Thank you. Okay. In the meantime, we will continue our procedure by preparing the chemical for the brush off. Please come with me. Thank you, Arthur. You're welcome. So, now that our leather is ready, dry and iron, we can continue our process by applying the brush-off mix that we prepared. I prepare a darker color than the base because we want to get a nice contrast once we're going to brush it off. So, now that we are done with the spraying, we are going to dry our leather again into the oven. Okay, now that our leather is ready, we got to my favorite part, the brushing off. We are going to use this small brush here, and normally this is a process that is done on the final product, like shoes and small leather goods. But today I'm gonna show it how we do it on the heights. Now that we get to the end of our process, you can see our final product and how it looks like before the brushing off and after. So before is very uniform and dull, and after is shiny, and you can see the two color effect. So here is the shoe that I show you at the beginning of the process. You can see how they brush it off on the final product. They leave some area with the, with the top dull, 
and some other area they are going to brush off and show the color which is underneath. Thank you so much for watching this tutorial video and I hope you enjoy as much as I did. Ciao!